Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and welcome to my channel. This is a tutorial channel for CAD softwares and in this video I would like to demonstrate how you can make use of my YouTube channel to its fullest potential for your benefit of learning online CAD softwares. So this is uh, Kitia V5 which is being opened over here. So let me just minimize Kitia V5 and show you my tutorial channel over here. So you can see over here these are the recent uploads and uh, these are the popular ones and over here you can find the playlist. So currently my channel is having tutorials on Kitia V5, AutoCAD, AutoCAD Mechanical, Marvelous Designer etc. And mainly I'm focusing on Kitia V5. I'm uh, mechanical engineering and I'm concentrating more on the engineering side of design and these are the different playlists what you can see over here so once you get into that particular playlist you get the, diff the different videos and you can actually follow them and there are videos uh, which is being named as for beginners and they are uh, particularly made for the beginner uh, learners of uh, Kitia softwares or any other softwares now let's just uh, come into the top and uh, let's just say uh, let me just show you how you can make use of the channel when you're having any doubts uh, let's just uh, take an example in the part design workbench let's say if you're having any doubt in the stiffener tool so come over here and you can actually click on the search button make sure you're in the channel that is www.youtube.com slash user slash shaakzscatia v5 online now let's come over here and type stiffener once you click on the search button you get the stiffener over here which is of 3 minutes and 38 seconds take a different tool maybe a closed surface which is a tool from uh, part design workbench to convert the surface to a part design and you get the uh, closed surface tool the video for closed surface tool is here which is of seven minutes and let's come into another one that is a split and when you click on the split you get two different kind of split one is a split in surface and one is a split in part so just put split part design and you get the split solid body option in the part design workbench now let's uh, go for another tool draft a lot of people have uh, doubts in the drafting so you get the four different kinds of drafting in the part design workbench so that was just a small demonstration on the part design and how a person can make use of my channel for uh, searching for videos so this is not the videos the other videos on YouTube these are exclusive videos from my channel these are all uploaded by me and uh, this is the in uh, you know this is a sub search button which is inside my channel now let's come into the wireframe and surface design workbench let's just say you have a doubt on rotate so press rotate and you get the rotate tutorial over here and let's take another topic extrapolating surfaces so you get the extrapolating surfaces over here it's not required that you need to type the complete thing you can put extrapolate also and you get the uh, the search or the search results over here so we'll go for another tool multi-section which is an important tool in uh, uh, what do you say the wireframe and surface design you get the multi-section and the uh, different kinds of multi-sections are all the list all listed over here now now let's take another topic in the assembly let's just go for a top-down approach a person doesn't know top-down approach which is a common question in uh, what do you say the interviews so the top-down approach is over here and I show you in this tutorial how you can do the top-down approach and what is top-down approach now let's come into another topic maybe a smart move tool so the smart move tool is here and yet another another tool reuse pattern the reuse pattern is over here now let's just uh, come into another tool contact constraint so remember that these are all different tools of Ketia V5 and all the different tools tutorials are 
available in my channel so con contact constraint is over here now let's just uh, forget about the assembly design and come to the drafting uh, let's just uh, search for a tool in drafting maybe a offset section cut you can see the offset section cut is the first, first search result over here now let's take another maybe inserting frames and title block so once you click on that you get the two different kinds of inserting title block one is manual and one is automatic both are listed over here now let's take another topic generating numbers and balloons you can see the generating numbers and balloons are listed over here now let's uh, forget about the drafting and come into the sheet metal workbench the generative sheet metal workbench now let's just say that you have a doubt on creating extrusions so extrusions and you get the creating extrusions tutorial here now let's go for creating a flange and you get the different kinds of flanges over here all are listed over here so you can take any of them and you can uh, go for the tutorial now let's go for creating a teardrop which is another option in the generator sheet metal and you get the uh, create teardrop option so by this particular video I hope you have uh, got an idea how you can use the channel to uh, benefit this is for your own benefit you can make use of this and find out the tutorial or uh, the cl clarifications that you need so sometimes my subscribers ask me that uh, do you have a tutorial on uh, teardrop or do you have a tutorial on inserting frames and title blocks so maybe the, those people are not aware of this particular option the in search option which is available once you get inside a particular channel so I hope uh, this tutorial is going to help uh, my viewers, my subscribers or the people who haven't subscribed please subscribe and uh, make use of this uh, channel and make use of uh, all the different features you have inside this uh, videos etc. And uh, if you have uh, any doubts or clarifications please comment below on any of the video. Let's just say you have a doubt on this particular video. Just come over here, come into this video and uh, just pause the video here wherever it is uh, I mean to say you can watch the video and you can uh, comment below over here and I'll be getting in touch with you as soon as uh, and if you have any doubts regarding any of the tutorial please comment below on that particular video and I'll be getting in touch with you and uh, And if you have any CAD projects, please feel free to write to me at kitia.pro.user at gmail.com. C-A-T-I-A.P-R-O.user at gmail.com. So I hope this video is going to benefit you. And thank you so much for watching. And please uh, subscribe, like my videos, and share the tutorial cha channel among your friends to have a good time learning online. Thank you.